Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I am going to be doing a wash day routine with the Olaplex system. And right now I am just dividing my hair up into a few sections. I've been super excited to try this Olaplex, but first I'm gonna go in with the number zero. This is the intensive bond building hair treatment. And it does say to apply to dry hair into small sections. It says to dampen the hair and not drench the hair. But what this intensive bond treatment is going to do, it's gonna prime your hair for deeper repair. It rebuilds hair bonds. It strengthens and protects the hair's integrity. So I'm just going in and I am just applying this all throughout my hair, trying to make sure that it gets damp. So I'm just gonna go ahead and twist up my hair. And as you can see, my hair is already starting to revert. And I did go ahead and leave that in for 10 minutes. And next I'm gonna go in with the number three. This is the Hair Perfector. So this is going to reduce breakage. It visibly strengthens the hair. It restores your hair's healthy appearance and texture by repairing damage and protecting the hair structure. And as you can see, my hair is already starting to revert. So, I mean, I guess this is doing its job because, I mean, just look at my hair. But in case any of you are wondering, I do wash my hair probably about once per month. So right now I'm just doing a pre-rinse before I go in with the shampoo just to get my hair wet. And as you can see, my curls are already popping. Who says heat train natural hair cannot be healthy? Clearly it can. So next I'm gonna go in with the number four. This is the Bond Maintenance Shampoo. So this is gonna repair and maintain bonds within the hair. It eliminates frizz and flyaways. It reduces damage. It's for all hair types and it is cruelty free. And I love how this is sussing up. And next I'm gonna go ahead with my shampoo massaging brush that I did get from Amazon. I love this brush. It really gets in there and it gets all the dandruff and the buildup out of my scalp. You know, since I haven't washed my hair in like a month, my hair really, really needs, my hair and my scalp really, really needs a proper cleansing to get all that buildup out because I am gonna go in later in the video and do a silk press and we want the silk press to be really, really nice. So right now I'm just washing out the shampoo and I really, really enjoyed the shampoo. It got my hair really, really clean, lots of suds, and I just love the shampoo. So right now I'm gonna go in with the number five. This is the Bond Maintenance Conditioner. So it's gonna repair hair, it's gonna maintain the bonds within the hair it also adds shine, it strengthens the hair, it's for all hair types and it's cruelty free. So I'm just basically seeing how much slip this has because you know, if it doesn't have slip, I don't consider the conditioner to be good, but this has some good slip. Like as you can see, I'm just using my Demnin brush and I'm going through my hair and it is just detangling like a breeze. And I'm just gonna go ahead and do the other side as well. And yes, really, really enjoyed using the conditioner as well. It worked really, really great in my hair. 
and just look at it just look at it the comb is just gliding through my hair I can even detangle with my fingers with this conditioner which is amazing so right now I'm just rinsing out that conditioner of course And I really, really did enjoy using these products. Worked really, really well in my hair. Video is not sponsored. I just really wanted to try this. But yeah, I'm just going in and removing some excess water from my hair just so I can go in with my Shea Moisture Manuka Honey and Mifura Intensive Hydration Hair Mask. And as you can see, I'm being very heavy-handed with the product I probably didn't need to use that much but you know I gotta be extra all the time but yeah I just wanted to go ahead and do a deep treatment mask to make sure my hair is properly moisturized I haven't had a deep treatment mask in like two months so I definitely needed to do this So I am low porosity. I usually deep condition with heat, but yeah, didn't nobody have time for that that day. But I did go ahead and leave this in for 10 minutes. And I'm just going ahead and rinsing that out because we're trying to get through this um, wash day. Yeah, it was taking forever because I was filming, but I really wanted to get this video out for all of you because I've been wanting to try these products. And here is what my hair is looking like. It's beautiful, curls are popping. So right now I did go ahead off camera and blow dry my hair. I do have a blow dry routine that I'll link above in the cards. And right now I'm just going in with my cheese silk infusion, you know, as my heat protectant before I flat iron my hair. This adds really, really nice shine to my hair as you will see in a moment how shiny my hair comes out. So right now I'm going to go in with my Sudu Professional Ceramic Flat Iron and go ahead and section off my hair and proceed to silk press my hair. And I always, always use a ceramic flat iron unless I'm at the salon and they use a titanium flat iron on my hair, but I only go to the salon probably about one to two times per year so i mean if you want to keep your heat trained hair healthy and still maintain your curl and the health of your hair always use a ceramic flat iron just an fyi so as you can see my hair is coming out really really well really shiny really silky like we love And I'm also just using my red towel comb to do the chase method. If you're enjoying the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel. I would love to have you here and I would love more people to know and understand that heat trained hair can thrive and still be healthy. Here is the finished product. You know I had to put some slow-mos in there for you.
be sure to subscribe. Thanks so much for watching. Give the video a like if you liked it. And I'll see you in the next video.